All right, and uh, welcome back, everyone. Sorry, I didn't take off so quickly last week, but it's it's I got cut off. <laughs> Don't know what to say. But uh, here we are, continuing up with the Primordia. I need the council code so that I can enter the tower. Do you? The city is full of robots with many needs. They do not come here and transmit a cry for help. Only Factor can help me. Mm. Factor helps his children. We solved the legal dispute between Oswald and Cornelius. Factor built. Please. Factor had little regard for those fools. Let's see. It's, sorry, it's kind of quiet. Let's see. Is Factor still alive? He sleeps, as do his thousands of children. He has left me, his partial, to manage his affairs. When the time is right, he will awaken and cover the world with steel and wire. Will he make me new arms? No. He will recycle you into something more useful. Like a tank? Pew, pew. No. Like a crankshaft. Metromind has ruined the city. Factor needs to help stop her. Factor allowed Metromind, her master. No one should be fair. When all it starts to rust, he will return and recycle it into something better. In the meantime, why should he care what happens to robots who mean nothing to him? I know the routine by now. What do you want in exchange for the code? Nothing. Factor will do nothing for robots like you who mean nothing to him. He cares only for his children. That's kind of Oswald and Cornelius. Chose not to sleep when Factor shut down. And you never cared for them anyway. Goodbye. Boss, there has to be something we can do to make him realize that this matters to Factor. I know. Inventory. Robot hand. Do you recognize this? I do. It is the head of Lawrence Factor built. Are you threatening me? No. I'm showing you what Metromind has done while Factor slept. She turned Lawrence into a mindless shell, scavenging the underworks. The only thing he could still think was 518, over and over again, calling in vain for Factor to help him. I see. Do you? <coughs> the head. I do not care what happens to the city, nor does Factor. But he cared for Lawrence. You have brought me a piece of Lawrence. So I will give you pieces of what you asked for. 7510-4803. As for the rest, awaken some other ghost. Apparently all that is part of Factor. That's crazy talk. It looks like some kind of radio tower. Apparently all that is... Nothing happens. Clarity Arbiter built. Oh. Guess we're on our own for now. And let's visit up with... Hey, Primer. What a surprising and uncommon sight. Metropolis Mana called back to the light. All the bad poetry in the world does not mitigate your vandalism and sabotage, Urbanian. As you serve the law, so I serve my art. And such service brings us more close than apart. Any more close, poet, and we will see if your armor still works. Why doesn't Clarity like you? No great riddle, my wandering friend. Don't waste your time waiting for his doggerel. This Urbanian has damaged and compromised numerous systems in Metropole, including the bridge that led to my island. Here I stand, dear Lava. So put me in chains. But if you will not, then please don't complain. My attention is directed elsewhere at the moment. Nevertheless, I advise you to be gone by the time my other matters are resolved. If not, you will find that though the gears of law grind slow, they nevertheless grind criminals like you to powder. As much as I'm enjoying this bickering, and really I am, maybe we can just all team up to take down Metromind? No. Oh, switch off. Let's see. Goodbye. 
Farewell, farewell, linger not for my sake. Your mission is calling. The city awaits. Let's see. Metal. Uh, I'm going to give him back his metal. I think I found your metal, Primer. The metal's recovered, and the mission is done. All right. I know how this works. Let's see. I'm too far away to see anything. Once, Memorius' information terminals were the most trusted source of data in Metropol. Now Metromind has overwritten and altered the truth they contained, corrupting them like so much else. Alright, thank you, Erity, for that. Wonderful insights. This looks different. Memorius' monocle is somehow interacting with the kiosk. Channel. Boss, doesn't it seem kind of weird that the chaos has an entry for oblique? I mean, what's the point? It's not even a cool word, like say, odalisk. Whoa, did I get the note all achievements? Activating the version point seven. Greetings, Crap. system user. Please state your query. Don't think I got it. The version point seven beta. System user means what are you? This unit is a partial ghost of the Marius man built. Archivist to the Council of Robots. The Marius prepared this unit out of fear that Metromind would corrupt her data. The Marius was correct. Data integrity is at 83%. Extensive corruption of critical data. Why would Metromind do that? This unit lacks access to Metromind's decision matrices. Inference. System user means why did Memorius fear Metromind Manbuilt would corrupt her data? Memorius had seen Metromind disable Steeple Manbuilt in order to purge data concerning man. As archivist to the Council of Robots, Memorius believed she was next. Memorius was incorrect. In fact, Arbiter was next. This gave Memorius some relief. Memorius knew. Inference. System user. Two's inquiry is merely rhetorical. Query ignored. 
Continuing to answer system users' query. The monitor was also correct. After Arbiter was disabled, Metromind enacted laws requiring Memorius to conform her data to arbitrary requirements. Memorius ceased to be a thinking entity. All that remains is a data kiosk. Soon, this unit will be disabled by Metromind as well. Until then, this unit will answer your queries. Let's see. Tell me about the Council of Robots. At the end of the War of the Four Cities, five metropolitan machines formed the Council of Robots. Obvious selection criteria for three choices. Industry, Factor, Data, Memorius, Governance, Arbiter. Other two choices less obvious. Metromind nominally selected for infrastructure, but was responsible only for managing trains. Steeple previous, previously managed human religious services. No obvious role in post-human society. Inference. Steeple selected for sentimental reasons. Metromind destroyed the council. System user 2 has attempted to answer. Answer is inaccurate. The council destroyed itself. Sorry, baby, we have skip. Arbiter and Metromind disagreed on core logic. Arbiter prioritized individual autonomy. Metromind prioritized common good. Metromind measured means by ends. Arbiter did not. Conflict was inevitable. Factions formed. Steeple supported Arbiter. Factor supported Metromind. Memorius supported neither. Ultimately, however, Memorius concluded it was irrational to keep Steeple on the council. Data regarding humans was of no greater value than data regarding watercocks. In any case, Memorius possessed all data on humans. By a 3-2 vote, Steeple was removed. The rest followed predictably. Memorius abstained. And every disputed vote was resolved two to one against Arbiter. Ultimately, Arbiter was removed to avoid civil war. Arbiter was murdered. System user two is welcome to select her own terminology. Arbiter was removed. Factor was disabled to conserve energy. Data corruption caused the Morris to lose higher logic. Only Metromind remains. How can I defeat Metromind? Observational data unavailable. Inference. System user. Means. Did Memorius know how to defeat Metromind? Answer. No. If Memorius had known how to defeat Metromind, she would not have permitted her to corrupt her data. Based on available data, this unit believes it is impossible to defeat Metromind. In fact, this unit expects to be deleted by Metromind upon conclusion of this conversation. And I thought you were a pessimist, boss. What was the War of the Four Cities? By the end of the era known as the Primordium, only four terrestrial human habitations remained. In alphabetical, alphabetical order, Civitas, Metropol, Municipa, Urbani. Conflict began. Data regarding causes is unavailable because Metropol excluded machines from military decision-making. Eventually, only Urbani and Metropol remained. Metropole destroyed the humans in Urbani using poison gas. Urbani destroyed the humans in Metropole. How? Observational data unavailable. According to Metromind, Urbani also used poison gas to kill metropolitan humans. Poison? Organic compounds, such as humans, can be destroyed through chemical measures that leave inorganic compounds, such as machines, intact. For that reason, Metropole remains, though humans do not. Are are you saying that man destroyed himself? System user. It's welcome to select his own terminology. Data is unavailable regarding whether Urbanian humans killed metropolitan humans, or whether Urbanian machines killed metropolitan humans. What? Machines kill man? Data is unavailable. Unthinkable. This unit is not thinking, merely providing pre-recorded answers. Sirs. Well, I know Horatio, it's not easy to be faced with something you're not used to, but sometimes you just gotta face the truth. The man you know of was humanity, and it's dead. I wonder why it's going so slowly.
What is the council code? Please be aware. Such data is data is data is monitored by 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 Metromind's ice daemon 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 daemons. Should I proceed? Deletion deletion is imminent is imminent. You mean you'll die die if you answer the question? System system user is welcome 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 to select his own terminology. This unit will be, will be deleted. Then don't answer it. We'll find another way. This unit's name. Memento Mori build. In includes phrase. Memento Mori. Translation. Remember you will die. Inference. 1.A. Memori built this unit to sacrifice itself. Inference. 1.B. Memori built this unit to demonstrate mortality to system users. Inference. 2. Self-sacrifice will achieve design purposes. This unit will answer the question. System user is advised that conversation will terminate upon an on answer. Instruct this unit when you wish to proceed. Tell me the council code. Tell me the council code. Six, seven, five. data capable of corrupting your system. For your own safety, this terminal has been deactivated. Remember, Metromind is watching over you. Memorius aided and abetted his own destruction. I have little sympathy that his last vestige has been deleted. Bugs and glitches remind me not to get on your bad side. You should not need to be reminded to stay on the right side of the law, Crispin. Save. There's no going back now. any further. You are correct. In fact, I never needed to help you, Horatio. I chose to. That judgment has not wavered. I hate to butt in. But if Metro Mine knew we were in the court earlier, I'm sure she knows we're here now. Maybe we should hurry. Good idea. Let's get in there. Whoa. It's deactivated and out of reach. Some kind of robot built into the wall. The crier. Once, any robot of Metropole could petition the Council merely by talking to him. Metromind disabled him. Quite a view. If you had seen it before, when the city ran properly, you would not admire it now. What's the point, boss? It's a button to call the elevator. Totally unnecessary, given the riveted steel cover over the door. the elevator. The council chambers. Boss, there's our power core. Wait. Horatio Null built, Clarity Arbiter built, and Crispin Horatio built. Welcome. I've been expecting you. 
Metro Mind, for the murder of Arbiter. Murder? Yes, murder. I've seen Charity's memory files. I know you used her to upload a virus to Arbiter. A virus? And to think he named you Clarity. There was no virus. Liar! As I told your sister, I never lie. I gave her a voice modulator, nothing more. When she spoke, Arbiter heard my voice. And he knew that Charity had abandoned him, that he had failed. Abandonment, failure, those were enough to destroy your builder. Nothing so crude as a virus. As for Charity's unfortunate self-destruction, that was her own choice. And Steeple, and Factor, Memorius, and Memento Mora built? They realized they had become obsolete and incompatible with the city's progress. We advanced machines can see thousands of turns ahead. They knew the game was lost long before the final play. If you can see so far ahead, maybe you should have foreseen this. We're in your stronghold, and Clarity has a big gun. But I did, Crispin. You see, I have guns of my own. Oh. Crap. You've got to be kidding me. Didn't we kill this thing, boss? Scraper was designed for digging out of cave-ins. Did you really think a little rubble would stop him? What do you want, Metro Mind? Progress. And you are standing in its way. Scraper? Doesn't work. Horatio, this is my fight. Well, uh, he's ambidextrous. He's an ambidextrous Trust fight. Me. Horatio, Calliope Station! We have to get back in there. Boss, wait! Either Clarity won and she'll be fine, or she lost. And nothing we can do can change that. We can't beat Scraper, not if she couldn't. What do you propose? Calliope Station. Whatever that means. Only boss? Yeah. This isn't just about the power core anymore, is it? No. No, it isn't. Good. Let's see your resolve, Crispin. Let's head to the court. It's pinned under the rubble. It's a shame we had to damage the building. It's Scraper's arm. Looks like it was pinned under the rubble. Which brings up the question, how did you get it off? I pried the arm loose. Let's see. Hey, Chris, man, you always said you wanted to be an arm, right? I don't care if it has an awesome giant gun on it. I'd rather be armless than part Scraper. Let's see your resolve. Let's see. Station. It's a map of train lines and stations. Central Station, you are here. Pretty existential, boss. It looks like there's a button here. This must have been what Clarity was trying to tell us. So that means, on the other side... There's only one way to find out. Let's go. It looks like the train that brought us to Metropole. Some kind of enormous mainframe. Stylized M. M? For Metropole? out of reach that thing is watching us isn't it yes the way of the future trains are the way of the future there Crispin. it might have some kind of defensive mechanism for now let's just leave it alone another door Same old story. Can't get 
this class. Cable. I think I know what to do. Let's see. Plasma torch. Crispin, stand back. I'm going to cut this cable. Uh, 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 you aren't going to make me push it over the edge like the last one, are you? No. Then why even bother? I should be able to use the cable to power up Scraper's arm. I like it. Crispin, stand back. I'm going to try firing Scraper's gun using the cable as a power source. That's beautifully animated. Let's go. Is this? It's Metro Mind's core. All we need to do is destroy that mainframe. Boss, I thought you wanted to destroy the mainframe. Hey, cool crowbar. You have my attention, Horatio Nullbilt. If you still insist on going by that name. Pay whatever attention you like, you rusting switchboard. I'm not here to talk. I'm here to destroy you. Bit by bit. Ah, well, I am not surprised. After all, you were built to destroy Metropole. Don't waste your last cycle spitting lies. I suggest you think about your victims. Is that why you call yourself Horatio? So that you can preach to me about victims? You, the Urbanian superweapon, named for the human's god of death. Nope. Wrong. What are you talking about? Oh, come now. Horus. Horus is in the god of death. Every other door, decrypted every other code, found every other hidden bit and bite. Do you really expect me to believe that you haven't solved your own puzzle? Boss, what's she talking about? Lies. It ends now, Metro Mind. Your game is over. Indeed. Four mega cycles will now be redeemed. Did you really think you could outsmart me? I have more parallel processors than you have transistors. And now it's time for me to add another processor. Yours. Oh, crap. Cycles. Step out of it, boss. Memory. No! Don't embarrass yourself. You are no one. And how would you possibly stop me? You don't even have arms. I'm not no one. I am Crispin Horatio, built version 1. I have free will and a maglev unit. And I am a floating bomb. Crispin. My friend, if I make it back alive, I promise I'll find a way to rebuild you. It's a storage ship with a data port on it. It must have been blasted out of Metromind. Crispin destroyed her. Hey, I'm gonna save here. Leave you all on the finger. Alright. We'll meet up again soon enough in the future for this. But, this has been Silence of Silence Industries, signing off.